For many veterans, getting your VA disability compensation can seem very overwhelming. Through my experience, most individuals aren't aware of the timeline, and this can be very frustrating. Today, I just want to take a few moments to explain what you should expect when pursuing your VA disability compensation. Before we begin, please note that there are several factors that determine the length of your timeline. Your location, the amount of your claims that you have filed, and the evidence can greatly impact your claims. This video is simply meant to be a general guideline for you. The first thing you have to do is file for VA disability compensation. The initial application that you have to file is called a VA Form 21-526. On average, it takes the VA 8 to 12 months to respond to your initial application. If you're granted benefits and are completely satisfied, then you are completely done. And pretty lucky because most claims are denied the first time. If your initial application for benefits is denied, you have one year from the date of the rating decision to file and notice a disagreement. Our firm refers this to as an NOD. The VA will take another 8 to 12 months, sometimes longer, to make another decision. Here is something that a lot of people do not tell you. Do not put off filing the NOD. Just because you have 12 months to file the appeal from the date of the decision, if you wait 12 months and then it takes the VA another 12 months, then you're, in the, you're pretty much waiting 24 months before the VA makes another decision. So my best advice to you is gather whatever evidence that you have or you may need to respond to the decision as quickly as possible. You can save 12 months by being proactive about your claim. Like I said before, it generally can take 12 months for the VA to get back to you on an NOD. The next decision is called an SOC, which is referred to as a statement of the case. At this point, you have three options to respond. You can either schedule a DRO hearing, which is called a decision review officer hearing, which is, um, or you can choose to request a BVA hearing, or you can do both. Our firm traditionally does both. At this time, you can request the DRO hearing and file a substantial appeal, which is called a VA Form 9. Each of these will take 8 to 12 months to the process. If you're denied at the BVA level or your claim is remanded, which means that it goes back to the, B I'm sorry, to the VA regional office for review, it can take another 12 months. If you'd like to know more about VA disability claims or for a free consultation, you can contact our office at 1-877-526-3457 or you can request a free copy of our VA disability guide.